I'm going to be making a card today using some Sunny Studio products. I'm going to be using a cute little stamp set here. This is called Devoted Doggies. And I love these cute little dogs. There's some great sentiments on there. And I'm going to be using the Windows Trio Square die. So it comes with these bonus stars. So I'm just going to snip those out so I could just use the window. So I'm taking my wire cutters. So I'm going to put this panel on my um, on my card front here. I'm going to do two rows. So this is going to be really cute to have these little dogs peeking out. So I have my panel all cut out. I have my card base. I'm going to do some inking on the background so it shows through the panel. I've got my distress inks here. I'm going to try not to get it up on the edges because I want the white edge. I should line that up with some washi tape so I don't make a mistake. Okay, we'll see how that goes. I've got Twisted Citron, Mustard Seed, and Seedless Preserves. So I'm going to go in with my yellow. Put in a little bit of green in there. I'm just taking a dry cloth and kind of just smoothing that out a little bit. Okay, so let's take this tape off. See how that worked. Hopefully it doesn't stick to my paper too bad. Looking good so far. When you pull off your tape, you kind of want to pull at an angle. So I'm going to add some foam tape to the back of this to give it some lift. So at the bottom I did not go far enough down. Let's see. But I'm going to be adding some sentiments so and some images so hopefully that will get covered up. 
I covered my panel from head to toe in double-sided foam tape there. I kind of blended out the line a little bit so it wouldn't be so noticeable. So let's remove my adhesive here, adhesive backing. And then we can position that right on the card base. And then I could have some fun coloring in the images. My favorite part. So what's your favorite part when you make a card? Is it coloring the images? Constructing the card itself? The creative process? Thinking of what you're going to make? Preparing? Getting the supplies? I love coloring and seeing the end result as the images come to life. Okay, so let's try to position this straight. So I'm trying to look at all my corners here, get them even on all sides. Okay, I'm going to push that down. Okay, so there it is. And then I'm just going to have my little dogs in the different windows there and some sentiments. So let's see how this car turns out. So I've got my stamps on my Misty here. And I am just going to stamp these guys in with this Nouveau Hybrid ink pad in black shadow. Okay, I'm going to pick out my colors and I will speed through the coloring and put on some music and I'll meet you at the other side.
So I kind of positioned how I want my little dogs. I put some double-sided um, foam tape on the back of them. Since part of the little images are going to be hanging off the edge, I'll just add a little bit of glue. So I'm just going to add a little glue there. And I want this little guy to look like he's jumping up. So I have my foam tape but nothing in the middle here so it could lay flat right there so I'm gonna glue this little rough I thought that was cute the little um, word outlined. And then I have a little bone and a little paw print somewhere. Oh, I don't know where the little paw print went. It was so tiny, I just lost it. It probably glued in under there. Oh no, it's on the floor. So I'm going to put a little bone on one side and a little paw print on the other. Sorry you had a rough day. So these images are super cute. I just colored them up to be different little doggies there. This one reminds me of Charlie. And he's just going to go right in the in the center there. Super cute. So I might add a few sequins. And that will complete my card. So thanks for stopping by. And I hope you guys enjoyed the little uh, process to make this card. It was super easy and fun. So I'll have a picture at the end of the video. Thanks for stopping by guys. Have a great day.